Man, if this arc doesn't end with Frankie putting his fist through Pandam's face, I don't want to see it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Shaq the Buster. I should know me. We have episodes 251 and 252 of our One Piece watch today. Last episode kept hitting the one fourth of the way to a thousand mark. But in the last two, we got a lot of the truth behind what actually went on in Water 7 whenever Tom was alive. Again, I'm assuming he's dead, but he maybe have just been in prison in East Lobby. But back whenever Tom saved Water 7, basically. And everything that happened whenever Frankie and Iceberg were his disciples and everything he taught them. And how basically the government once again screwed them over and basically framed everything on Tom. And by everything, I mean attacking the judicial ship. When in reality, a lot of the only problem they originally had with Tom was the fact that he built Roger's ship. We're going to get into it, see what's going on, because they said they're going to take Frankie to, to any lobby. If you're new to the channel, drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's hop right into these bad boys. <laughs> I like how the snail's faces change based on whoever's talking through them, like their inflection. Spandam! Why does he call him Spanda? God dang, dude. Bro, that's your boss? Embarrassing. Usopp's just there to witness all of this. I mean, they don't have beef with him, technically. He's not even part of Luffy's crew anymore. Don't do this, Usopp. Please, man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this is awkward. Is he gonna tell them, tell Usopp what happened to Luffy and them? Maybe it'll kick him into action. Go find them, hopefully. God, I, I feel so different about Iceberg now. We know so much about Iceberg now. The little mouse, he can't do anything to help. Oh, Jumpa, MVP. Oh, he's gonna cut the, to cut the ropes and save them. The only departure, that was the departure to Innie's lobby. Yeah, what? Is it like completely fine to travel during Aqua Laguna? So this is why there was one at what, 11 p.m. to any lobby? He knows everything. Uh, I want to hear his guess. Oh. From the back streets? The corner at Blue Nose. Maybe he is talking about them. They don't work much. Okay, maybe not. The shipwrights were always in the yard. From what we saw, at least. I mean, unless they're in disguise, maybe you won't see them. God dang! Chopper Giga Chat saving both of them! I like how he has Zoro's blade in his mouth, how Zoro would like hold it. Hell yeah. That's my that's my chopper, baby. And the mouse! All saved by a straw hat. <laughs> and he's still focused on helping medical treatment. This little mouse is so adorable, man. Yes! Save the reindeer! Oh. Is it because he's a straw hat? Well, technically not. But he does uh, is a witness. And he's a pirate, yeah. And technically they're government officials. Oh! Ah! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Is he gonna drop it? <gasps> you monster! No! Kaku, I liked you, bro! Damn, he was the one that inspected it originally. Oh, no. That would destroy it completely. Just has to watch. No! That can't be the end of... No. No. Oh my gosh. Dude, honestly, where is Sanji? I don't I think it's been like 20 episodes or something crazy like that. 
He's awake. He's alive. Look at that little mouse. Knowing the backstory of Water 7 2, I'm really happy that Iceberg is the one that's in charge. That he's the mayor that everybody looks up to. Iceberg can vouch for them. He knows everything now. Nami's up too. Bro, there's no way that's your, your priority right now. I thought it would be like just completely making sure Iceberg's okay. We're talking to Iceberg. The guy's up. Just talk to him. Guys, give us some space. Why don't we all take a step back from the burning building? But who is just throwing rocks? Bro, a tap on the shoulder works. The mouse is so happy, man. Oh. More that Tom told him? To say the least. I just want to know why Tom knew about her or knew that she was going to be involved in this so early on. I guess because but she was a child even then. Because she could decipher stuff? Do they both want a Pluton blueprints or just a Pluton in general? That's what I'm saying. I think Frankie would die without giving them up too. And there's no reason for her to help the government. She has to owe them or something or they have some dirt on her. I don't know. She just wants to know the history. That's it. I knew there was more to it? I said Iceberg's been saying this forever And now it's like that with ranking times 20 Times a thousand Times ten thousand Maybe he changed her mind right here Convinced her that it wasn't worth finding The Ohara devils were the ships that she destroyed, right? Didn't she destroy them? Oh. Which is two conditions. Uh -huh. Or else what? Yeah. Yeah. CP9 ああ。国家戦争クラスの軍事力を標的にされたら。You're Foster, it, like, uh, Luffy and all them would have been done. Wait, so she did it to save them. But it was a curse to have her with them because she's the reason Buster Call would have been exercised. Hmm. But if she had told them, they would have wanted to try to figure a way out of it with her. Oh! You say, I mean, uh, I would see why he would see her as insane to give up the, that power to the government just to save Luffy and them. But where are the blueprints? Because, yeah, because he, he doesn't know them as well as she does. Dude. Oh. <laughs> She's like uplifted by that. Yeah! They lost! It starts now. Optimus Nami. Oh, yeah. I like this attitude. Even Iceberg is like shocked. Don't hit him! But he just saved like half of you! Nami, stop! Bar yeah, where's where's Sanji? Yeah! That was the last we saw of him. He's been gone for a minute! It was daytime! Daytime was like 16 episodes ago! Sanji didn't lose faith. 
こんなの嘘は許すのが男だ This is a raised water level. Did Sanji like sneak onto the train or something? Wait, that would have been Giga Chat because he saw on the board that one was going to any slobby. Ah, they're not going to get to see if their theories were right or not. Wait, that scar is he? That's not one of the Elder Stars, is it? Oh, there he is. He is trying to sneak on, I think. Bingo. Oh, shoot. Is this about to be like Sanji James Bond, like sneaking around? I mean, he can tell her he forgives her, like he can, like they can try to figure it out, but they're too deep in now. Everything with Frankie, the Pluton, it, it, it's too messy to just straight up leave now. I mean, we've reached the point where we found a big chunk of what Robin's dream is. So it has to be settled one way or another. Not to mention everything with Mary and Usopp leaving the crew, Luffy being defeated, Zoro being defeated, everybody being out of the loop on everything and that's a lot it's a very nasty situation very messy let's go episode 252 i don't think he's one of the elder star i'd have to go back and look the scar looks familiar oh wait that's corgi never mind i'm dumb that is corgi okay he's not an elder star is the darkness like the fact that they would be targeted? Yeah, that'd cause a bit of ruckus though. And then the straw hats would definitely be targeted. She's just trying to protect them. Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> this man, bro. Ay, ay, ay. I like how he acknowledges how she's powerful enough to stop all of them either way. <laughs> bro, the heart, the heart clouds. Yeah, it is Corgi. Okay. There's CP9. That's Rob Lucci's son. They do look really intimidating. I like their designs, all of them. Oh. And they have Usopp. <laughs> so I'm just like, huh. He looks familiar. <laughs> it looks clean. Oh. Yeah, I'm shocked that Lucy isn't the leader of CP9. Gosh, Galila is just obliterated. It's so sad. They're all trying to save her, save anything they can. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so hype. Little Chopper's okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's just so fascinated by him. That little mouse, man. There's no way they can catch it. They'd have to get there a different way. There's no way they'd be able to sneak on the train either way, though. That's why I feel like Sanji might, because one person alone is different. Aqua Laguna just has terrible timing. Not a, I mean, dude, how long was the Aqua Laguna last, too? Doesn't Kokoro have some part in the train, though, running? Maybe she's the key of this. The direction! Just look that way! Polly's questioning his entire existence. <laughs> oh man, this is tough to explain. Oh. He's saving them. He's saving their names. Wow. Shameless girl. <laughs> he doesn't want to have people question the shipwrights from now on just because of them. Go, go, go! Yeah. Not until everything's figured out and settled. Dang. Good guy, Polly. Still my number one contender for the shipwright position. Dude, they need to get to like higher ground. Look at Chopper. <laughs> but he's got Soro's sword. Let's go find them. Oh man, the winds. It begins. Aqua Laguna. Did you just find the highest vantage point? Where is he? Oh, okay. He's just yelling for them. <laughs> quietly whispers it. Come back to us. 
Chopper. They're all yelling. This is so wholesome, actually. What's up? Come back to us. <laughs> That's so wholesome. So she's going right to the train station. It's, it's Chopper's job to find them, fill them in. They just don't know the extent of the whole thing with the Pluton and all that. I mean, they kind of do. Poor Robin. <laughs> Bag it. Government dogs. Uh oh. They're gonna get beat for that. Sanji, what are you doing, man? Go. Time to move. He's not even on. Yeah, you're kind of jinxing it. Park on some wood. There's no way they can make it there and like quietly get on the train though. Let alone find Luffy and Zoro and get on the train. Poor Iceberg, his whole world is just falling apart. It's already falling apart. Frankie's wondering the same thing about you, Iceberg. Who's told you're dead? Gotta be around here somewhere. I think Zoro was on one of the rooftops. He's still doing it. It's such a dumb bit. Uh, they've been in battle. Finally, go, go, go! Oh, that's right. He's stuck between a building again. That's right. Just chucked him in. My God. No wonder they can't find him. Oh, no wonder they can't find him. Oh my. What do you mean, Slam? I. They disappoint me on, on such a new level. It's it's impressive. How are they supposed to find them? They're really high up. I mean, Luffy's really high up. Zoro's just in a chimney. At least they're safe from the flood. If Luffy was stuck somewhere low in between a building, he would literally just, just die. I guess a regular person would too. He would just drown either way. They gotta leave. I'm not shocked they are. The pigeon has a matching jacket! Oh my god! That's so cute. Yeah, because you're a rat and a liar, Luchi. That's why it's easy to say goodbye. Is, is Sanji walking? Bro. Sanji, how are you going to get on board quietly, brother? Yeah, yell louder for it to stop. Maybe it will. It's so sad that this is the, the train that, that Tom built. It's being used for things like this. Like, just it, it's all part of this operation. Oh my god, she's thinking back to this? Saved your life. Mm. <laughs> she knew it would catch up to her eventually. She had to be prepared for it. At least we know now why she did it. They know. What's the plan here, Sanji? Like, brother, it's leaving. And he's just walking. If you try to force your way on, they're gonna notice, right? These guys will notice. I mean, I guess there's no way for them to warn anybody. He's walking up to it. Aww. I cannot believe they're still lost. I don't know how they can even get unstuck. Zoro's is honestly more disappointing. He slipped. I think Luffy was just thrown right into that. Did Sanji just get on the back? That's too late for Nami. I don't see Sanji. If this man did not make it on, we will have some problems. That he took his dang sweet time. I mean, maybe he was taking his time so that no one would see when he got on. But obviously he was walking towards the train that he made it on. One million percent. One billion percent. If not, then the last 16 episodes of him being MIA were for nothing. I'm pretty sure he's just been scouting this entire time, trying to figure out what was going on without getting in the middle of all of it, which was a good idea. Because if he hadn't, then no one would have gotten on that train. Aside from, I guess, Frankie and Usopp are there, but they're taken prisoner. Zoro. Luffy again has an excuse. Zoro slipped and fell in a chimney? Brother. My question is now, like, how are they going to have any part in anything that happens wh wherever Innie's lobby is? The train is going to take that group there, and how the hell is this group supposed to get to Innie's lobby? They can't even sail there, I'm assuming, because of Aqua Laguna, even if Mary was in good condition. So it's going to be very interesting to see this split perspective because of how far apart 
they're going to be. I always say I'm, it's kind of a toss up for me whenever the gang is all, uh, all split apart, but this is a very interesting dynamic based on everything that's going on. But guys, that's been it for episode 251, 252 of our One Piece watch through. Do drop us up on the channel if you are new, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Please, peace.